Hello everybody, welcome to her back to my channel. It's Kayla here and today I'm gonna be doing a little bit of a shorter stream today because I have something later on. So yeah, we're just gonna be doing some progress on the island, checking out what's going on, you know, maybe doing some construction and stuff. But yeah, I'm so happy to be back and streaming. Welcome in everybody. All right. Hi Noah, how's it going? Happy Wednesday. Amy, hello. Jilly, welcome in. Thank you so much for being here. Caroline, hello. Nikki, hello. Thank you so much for being here, mods. Um, okay. Clementine, hello. Thank you guys so much for 11 likes on the stream already. I appreciate it. Um, let me just quickly s fix the settings real quick because I think the ads are just like randomly automatically put and I don't want to make it too much. Um... There we go. There we go. How is everyone doing today? Let me know in chat, you know, one to 10, how are you feeling? I haven't played Animal Crossing since the last time I streamed actually. So we did, um, we did like this area over here last time, over here. Brit, thank you so much for the 14 months. Oh my goodness. Hello, welcome in Brit. Thank you so much for the member milestone. Hype in chat for Brit, everybody. All the hearts for them. Thank you so much for being here and for supporting the channel. A little zoom in moment. Thank you so much. Let's go. 14 months is insane. But we did this part. Anyways. <laughs> Sorry, I was like freaking out. Um, we did this part last time, which I think was is pretty cute. It's like kind of like a mystical pond, fairy pond yard for this dude. Don't know who this is. Don't. I probably should know. Uh, I think this is Wolfgang because he's literally in front of his house, but we did Wolfgang's house. We have this like kind of empty area here between the campsite and Wolfgang's house. And I kind of want to like just do maybe like a transitional spot over here, um, just a filler area. Seta, welcome in. How are you today? Happy Wednesday. How is everyone doing today, by the way? Let me know. Um... But yeah, let's go find, I don't know if I have my storage shed with me, but let me, oh, I do, I do. Okay, I wanna check out what's happening in my villagers first. See if anybody's moving out. Um, we love a good villager hunt. My villager hunts have been pretty good lately. Oh my gosh, look at Sky. Look at Sky and Filbert, the two blue, the two blue villagers. I got good luck with my villagers since I reset not a single bad one. Nice, who'd you get? Who'd you get set up? Okay, we need to get rid of Mac. We need to get rid- We need to. Okay. Check out what's happening here. Um, oh yeah, we did this area last time too. Wow, okay, so I totally forgot how much progress that we've done <laughs> on this island. But the whole back area is a mess, guys. She's a mess. It's very, very, very- there's gonna be a lot of trees and like stuff we have to move, but um, let me check what's in the shops too. I always forget to, do you guys check the shops every day when you play Animal Crossing? Let me know if you guys check the shops, cause I always, I probably should just to get more stuff. Oh, it's not here anymore. Let me go over to the shopping area. Lily's just enjoying. Lily's working out. Lily's better than me, to be honest. I need to do that. Okay. Go to the shops. Up here. Sorry guys, if you hear my dog, he's just like making sounds in the background. Um, it's hardly ASMR day. <laughs> he's like wanting, me. every time I stream, my dog's just like decides to cry for attention. Like it's just every time every time i haven't played animal crossing in months and this is making me want to dust off my switch oh my gosh yes brit play with me do you guys have animal crossing burnout does anyone have burnout i love mac he was my first villager on my island but i replaced him sadly hi jasmine so yeah i think he's not the okay he's not like a bad villager don't get me wrong like he's not like the worst villager he's a nice guy oh my goodness harley he just pooped when my dog poops, he does this like, <laughs> he like 
I don't know how to explain it, but he goes crazy after he poops. He's really happy. Love that. Love that. That is during stream. Um. <laughs> Who'd you replace him with, Jasmine? Also, hello, happy Pokemon. Welcome in. Hello, beautiful gem. I'm so happy to catch you live. The biggest, warmest hug. Thank you so much for being here, happy Pokemon. I hope you're doing well and sending you a big warm hug back. Thank you so much for joining. But yeah, my dog just is a paid actor at this point. Like he, he just does all the naughty things, does all the stuff. The second I click live, he's like, it's my time to shine. It's my moment. And I'm like, Harley. Now's not the time to poop. It is not the time to poop and run around. But it do be like that sometimes. I don't know if you guys have pets in stream, but it. <laughs> Nikki, how are you? How are you? How have you been enjoying the supermarket game? Like the grocery game? Because I keep seeing you stream it, but I always miss it. So I see like the thumbnail and I'm like, ooh, this game looks really fun. How is the game? I'm good too. Thank you for asking. Life has been busy though. I haven't had time to play. I did play Fortnite the other day. I love it. It's so addicting. I need to check it out. Is it free? How much is it? I'm just curious. Teddy, Pajmina, Aurora, Twiggy, Deli, Kid, Poppy, Cherry, Groucho, Piper, and Teddy. Oh wait, there's two Teddies. Do you have a duplicate Teddy set up? I'm jealous. I'm very jealous. I would like two Teddies. Thank you. It's $10. Oh, <gasps> maybe I should get it. I don't know, I feel like it'd be fun. <laughs> I always see like um, people streaming it. V, welcome in. How are you doing today? How was your trip? Oh my gosh, how was your trip? I saw the pictures, looked amazing. I hope you had a great time. Um, Happy Pokemon says, I missed you, gave up the kid core. My third attempt and I just can't. I restarted last week and I'm working on Dandelion, my farm core island. I'm having fun again. Honestly, okay. The island that I toured of yours was so good. Like I've never seen such a beautiful island. So I feel like any theme that you do, it's gonna be gorgeous. It's gonna be gorgeous. I'm telling ya. Um, I believe I replaced him with either ketchup or sherb. I won't lie, I will take him over Cephalobot. He's my enemy. I've had him move in or found him five times and we just asked why. <laughs> Honestly, Cephalobot is a gnar. Cephalobot is a big gnar. I'm not gonna lie, the octopus, I almost said octopuses, the octopi are seriously my least favorite villagers, I would say. Um, Nikki, thank you for the like command. Thank you guys for liking the stream. Uh, my trip was good. I'm still here actually until April 9th. Oh, you're still on your trip. Oh my gosh, thank you for being here. It looks really fun. London is just, did you like London, V? I feel like London is like one of my favorite places. Um, hope you enjoyed. Deli is the best monkey. He's always with someone, but he and Pajmina are always together. Who are like the two villagers on your islands that are always together? Like they're besties. Who is it on your island? Because for me in this island, it seems to be Filbert and Sky for some reason. <laughs> like they're always like on the plaza, just zooming around. And I'm just like, this is the life. I need a life like this. No job, no responsibilities, no just head empty and just running around, just zooming. I feel like that would be ideal, to be honest. Octopi, Vera, welcome in. How are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. How are you doing today? London was fun, super fast paced, but I did a ton. Yeah, I think it's like super, like for people who aren't from cities, I think it's definitely is a lot it's a lot i don't know if you guys have been to Nor uh, new york i almost said north new york city but do you guys if you have been let me know if you like new york city because there's a lot of people who say it's too much like it's really fast paced like cities like that big international cities like that um pashmina is always singing i love it <laughs> i love the singing villagers they're just like me as a villager if I was a villager, I'd be peppy and I would just be like performing for absolutely no reason to like nobody. It's given KK. I feel bad for KK though. He's always performing on Saturdays and there's like one person in the audience. I'm like, oh, that's so sad. 
maybe I should be in the audience next time. Okay, I'm just gonna do, I think I'm just gonna do this path over here just to fill it up a little bit. It's really pretty, like the pinks. My island is no theme, it's just vibes. And what I feel like doing, I'm trying 100% Animal Crossing my way. Let's go. Honestly, it's like, it's the best. No theme is the best. Oh, that's not right. That is not right. Um, but a vibe core island, honestly, a vibe core island is a vibe. I like it. I live in a city, so I'm kind of used to the hustle. Yeah, it is. Yeah. You get used to it, to be honest. I am very used to it because I, I've never ever lived like in my whole life. I've never lived in the suburbs or like anything like that. It's always been cities. Um, yes, I made friends with the sewage rats in New York. Um, I've been playing either Animal Crossing or Stardew Valley. Everyone's playing Stardew. I don't know. What do you guys think of Stardew? I have like very, I'm very opinionated towards Stardew. I played it, I think like two years ago or something. And I was like, this is fun, but like, I don't know how I feel about pixel art. But a lot of people are playing it right now. I think it's the pixel art for me. Love Stardew, Brit says. I think it's fun. Like I prefer Coral Island to be honest. I think it's more my thing. Like, it's more like the art style, I would say. I've been playing DDV more. I want to get back into Stardew, though. Can you play co-op in Stardew? Like, can you play with other people? Maybe I should get back into it just to play with you guys. <laughs> you can make, like, a, a ginormous, chaotic butterfly farm. Wouldn't that be great? Just all farmers together. <laughs> Oh, I have this here. Okay, I'm gonna use this. Stardew has been fun to start over. Ooh. Oh yeah. Get to start over your farms too. I feel like there, are, I know there was like um, some updates too. And people have been wanting like pronouns and stuff, which I hope that they do because a lot of people in the LGBTQ community play Stardew. So I've been seeing a lot of like updates and stuff. Um, like people talking about it, but I haven't played it. 1.6 update on Steam. Do you guys play on Switch or like, do you guys play most of your games on Switch or on PC? Jill has an obsession. <laughs> I'm addicted to Stardew. Oh my goodness. Not on Switch yet. I'm excited to play it soon. I'm a Coral Island fan, so it'll be interesting to see the difference. Yeah, that's true. I know you like Coral Island. I know, I know V loves <laughs> loves Coral Island. All the all the husbands. That's why we play the game, honestly. Honestly, most people play Coral Island for the for the people to get married. I love Coral Island. <laughs> Okay, let me get some regular trees. Some pink trees. Waku has my heart though. I failed. I failed to to get Waku in Coral Island. Patiently waiting for my passport to come. It better come before the 15th. Ooh, are you traveling? Are you traveling on the 15th? I hope that it comes soon, Saraf. Oh, I hate this. No apple trees. No apple trees. I hate these apple trees. They're my literal enemy. Hi, Charlie. Welcome in. How are you feeling? Are you feeling better, Charlie? I know last time you said a major life update happened and you were a little down. I hope you're okay. I hope you're feeling better now. How are you today? I mean, graphics wise, Coral Island 100%, but everything else I like to. What are the differences? Do you guys. For those of you who play both of them, like, do you notice any, like, major differences between them? I'm doing better! Let's go! That's great to hear, Charlie! That's great! You know, like, what I always say. Bad, you know, when bad things happen to you, that means good things will happen too. Because, like, it's the balance of life, you know? 
it can't just all be bad. It can't just all be good. Like, you can't really... You know what I mean? Like, you can't really compare and know it's good if you don't have bad times, so... I'm glad that you're better. Had the best time in Paris over the weekend. I'm so jealous. I'm so jealous of people who live in the UK. They can literally, like my sister lives in the UK and she's just like, I'm going to Portugal for the weekend or I'm going to Paris for the weekend. I'm like, bruh, L that, that is lucky. I would do anything to just like, just pop over, just pop over to Paris, you know? I'm jealous. Okay, we have a mug, a storefront. Um, hi, Holly. Welcome in. Just popping in to say hello. Good night as I'm going to bed early. Oh, I'm sorry about that, Holly. Yes, take care of yourself. Thank you so much for popping in. And yeah, feel better soon. Take, take good care of yourselves, guys, please. I bought Stardew and I didn't know how to play, so I gave up. It looked fun when others play. I like watching people play Stardew. Like, there are a lot of Twitch streamers that play Stardew, um, but I don't know. I don't know. Farming farming games are just not my thing. Like, give me a pew pew game. I'm more of a, okay, I'm more of a pew pew kind of girl than a, a cozy girl, but Animal Crossing is, like, the only cozy game that I'm obsessed with. Where in the UK does your sister live? My sister lives in London. She lives in London. I went to visit her the other day. I'm going on a small vacation, 15th, 18th. My brother and sister, nice. I hope you have a good time. Very nice. I feel like now a lot of people are just traveling. I wanna travel so bad. I'm stuck here. She is British. Proper cup of tea. I swear, I'm gonna get cancelled for this, these British accents by the British. We're going to Mexico! Oh my gosh, enjoy, Setup. Enjoy! Oh, we have these tents. Let's put these tents. Let's put these here. I think these are nice, like, around the campsite area. So you kind of get, like, a little hint of what's coming up. Um, okay, let's put this... I miss Mexico. Yeah, it's so beautiful. I really love it. I I love going to um, Tulum. Tulum's beautiful. Okay, got that. Oh my gosh, this music. V? <laughs> Why does this music remind me of V? Let me know. Let me know. Um... It reminds me of that like other Nintendo song that you loved. If you if you remember, you remember. And my passport comes out well. Yeah, I hope I hope it comes soon. These things take such a long time sometimes though, so hopefully it's it's fine. I don't like this. I don't like this. I'm crying. <laughs> when you down when you download a Nintendo playlist and get surprised get surprised by this banger this absolute bop i love it i don't know what to do here guys what should we do because it's kind of flat it's really flat um let's see Ooh, we have these we have one of these. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't take this music seriously. It's, it's too good. Looks pretty. Oh, maybe between these trees. Let's do that. Like that. Oh, we need to put some stuff under here too, though. Mm. Some rocks, maybe. And at some point I have to I have to get rid of this whole thing here. Oh, that's gonna be that's gonna be a, a feat. That's gonna be difficult. Alright, let's do that. that. And then put the party lights. It reminds me of Totoro, those animals that march. I was gonna say this is giving like Oompa Loompas marching. 
need some flowers now. Let's get some flowers. Kind of vibing with it though. <gasps> it's Mac. Okay, we need to talk to Mac and make sure that he leaves. So we have to give him something. I think I might give him a. I think I might give him an apple. He's actually one of the starters on this island. So it's actually like about time that little Mac leaves. Has anyone seen the new Willy Wonka? I was gonna watch it on the plane, but I didn't. Oh, Wonka, yeah. I haven't seen it, but um, I really want to. It's the one with um, Timothy Chalamet, right? Mac is a baby. He's such a baby. Look at his, look at his eyebrows. Are those wrinkles? Does he have wrinkles? He's so cute. Um, but apparently people are saying that like Timothy is like literally in every single movie now. Like he's literally in like a hundred movies right now, which is crazy. Timothy Chamoy. <laughs> Still haven't tried Chamoy. I always see those like Chamoy pickle, um, Chamoy pickle TikToks like all over the For You page. Yeah, he's the, he's the guy in Dune. Have you guys seen Dune? It was really good. And I love um, Anya Taylor Joy. Like she's she's a great actress, and she had like two seconds of that film. She was literally just it just showed her face for like two seconds. I was like, wow. I would love to get paid just to stare at the camera for five seconds. But yeah, Dune was really good. Florence Pugh is my favorite. Yeah, she's really, she's also really good. She's pretty. I think she, I'm not sure, but I think that she's also acting with Timothy in another movie. I'm waiting right now for Bridget Bridgerton season three. Ooh. I love playing alongside of you so much. I always get inspired just by watching you. Thank you so much, Happy Pokemon. Thank you for saying that. I'm really glad. Are you are you decorating too? What are you decorating? I'm like very confused what to do here. I feel like something should be under here. Like maybe like a <gasps> a blanket, a blanket. Oh, I got it, I got it. We need a blanket like this wait let me see if this i just noticed that my passport is in transit let's go period <laughs> maybe like this an awkward square mm, let's see is that too small oh that looks kind of cute like that wait that looks kind of cute um, I just finished decorating my new campsite and planted colorful flowers around my house. I love the flowers so much. I think, honestly, I agree. I think the flowers in Animal Crossing are, like, the best part. Like, one of the best parts of the game. Because they're so pretty. Like, look at this hyacinth. I think the hyacinths are so pretty. They're gorgeous. Um, mm. I don't know how I feel about this. Hi James, welcome in, welcome in. How are you doing today? Oh, we have this one actually. Oh, okay. Hmm. I think that's better. I think this one's better. Let's do this one, lace. Hopefully it shows around the uh, edges. I'm good, how are you? I'm good too, thank you so much for being here. Do you play Animal Crossing too? Oh, that's not right. <clears throat> oh, that's pretty. Maybe I should put something else, actually. Your island is getting along so beautifully. I love watching the progress so much. It's relaxing. I often get stressed out when I'm decorating because sometimes I can't execute what I have in my mind. Mood, happy Pokemon. That is a struggle, honestly. That is a struggle because, like, sometimes you get these, like, great ideas, like, in your head, and then you can't really, like, it's hard to 
turn it into a physical reality on your island felt. Um, but thank you, Happy Pokemon. I love the colors on this island. I think the colors is what makes it so pretty. I haven't played for a while. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people are playing. I don't know, it's so sad, guys. Like, I seriously miss, like, the 2020 times. Like, when everybody was playing Animal Crossing. I feel like people have stopped playing, which is so sad. I don't know. Makes me sad. Okay. Ooh, we have this part here. Should I do a rock garden on this island? Yes or no? Rock garden, yes or no? Go through the pain, the struggle. Should I do it? Because somebody else said I should do rock garden, and I was like, it would be really pretty on this island, but the problem is it, mm, it is a difficult thing. Maybe we'll do a stream of just like, a whole stream. Like maybe it's gonna be like a six hour stream of just doing a rock garden. It takes so long, guys. If you've ever done one, let me know. Dee Dee, welcome in. They can be so cute. They're really cute. I think it's cute when it's like a fairy circle. You know what I mean? Like a fairy circle, a circle rock garden with something in the middle. Pizza, welcome in. Amy, hello. I'm struggling now. My husband challenged me with doing a Muppets themed island. Any ideas for a character to play animal? I haven't seen them. I don't even know what the heck. I don't I've never seen the Muppets. I- <laughs> I'm no help. I'm no help, Amy. But if anyone else has, like, seen it. Um. Jilly, thank you for the lurk. Get cozy, get cozy. Yeah, I've never seen the Muppets. I don't know. I've never seen it. As a kid. I haven't either. But. Sorry I'm late. No worries. Welcome in, welcome in. It's gonna be a little bit of a shorter stream today though, because like I said, I have um I have something later at four uh four thirty. So up until four thirty, we're gonna be causing chaos. AKA I'm picking up all the stuff on the floor, because there's so many sticks and like stuff on the floor. It's kind of it's kinda chaotic. I saw someone do an autofill challenge. I love it. You let all plots autofill and build your island around those villagers. It gives unlovable villagers a chance. I'll do that next. That is actually a really good idea. I think I've seen someone do that too. Imagine if you just get all the best villagers and you're just like, oh. Oh. This didn't this didn't work as planned. You get all like Shino, we get like Raymond, autofilling, like Marshall, like that would be crazy. That would be crazy. All right, let's put a book here. I feel like somebody was just like reading here and they just left their book, just chilling on the floor, as one does. Okay, this needs to go though. This like big, ugly cliff. She needs to go, the pansy cliff. Um, I think we can actually have space to get rid of the some of the pansies. <laughs> Peyton did that and made it into murder mystery. Ooh, that's crazy. I think I remember that. That was a while ago, I think. Really good idea. It's okay, thank you. Tattleby Kermit and Gala is Miss Piggy. Oh wait, I do remember the pig. <laughs> Maybe I did see it, but I don't remember anything about it. Yeah, there's a pig. I think Gala would be perfect for that. What about like Henry for Kermit? Oh, that's where Kermit is from. Wow. <laughs> when you're slow. When you just didn't have enough coffee today. Um, I only autofilled on my plot today. I instantly replaced her with a horse. Can't have a space squirrel on my farm cry island. Wait, which horse did you get, Happy Pokemon? Do you guys have a favorite horse villager? Because why is Cleo and Renee... Why are they queens? Like, they're absolute queens. They're so cute. They're the best horses. There's also a horse that looks like in a puke green color, which we don't stand, but I do like the horses. Um, Ioni is definitely not a farm core villager. <laughs> definitely not. But she's really cute. Okay, let's get all of these flowers and all these trees. 
Elmer is cute, but the name is not it. It's really not. Elmer is really cute too. I don't know. I, I always loved horses growing up. Like I was a huge horse girl growing up. I had a few horses of my own too at my grandma's house. Um, so I don't know. I have a soft spot for like, I have a soft spot for horses. Annalise, I needed a snooty. Yeah, she's really cute too. I do like Annalise. I think I had her before too. Jilly, welcome back. Enjoy, enjoy the coziness. Honestly, being in pajamas, like, being in pajamas all day, every day. I wish. I wish. Oh my gosh, I have a question for you guys. I have a question. I've been thinking about this, like, just recently, because I've also been, you know, just prioritizing coziness. Um, if, if you could, and nobody cared, there were no like societal norms of how you should dress. How would you dress every day? If nobody cared and you could literally wear anything you want. Would you wear pajamas? Would you look wear fashionable stuff? Like if you could and it was normalized, what would you wear every day? Cause why would we, <laughs> why would we all, I feel like gamers, like we would just all live in like those, like, you know, those blanket hoodies. We would just like casually walk in the street with a big, freaking blanket hoodie pastel lolita oh my gosh yeah i think i would just be cozy like i would just wear like honestly like slides sweatpants and a hoodie like just everywhere like maybe to a job interview even if i could like i i live in pajamas literally what was i gonna get oh we're gonna sell the flowers Visa's pajamas. Hi, Vane. Welcome in. How's it going, Vane? V, you don't have PJs? Oh, wait, not this one. Yeah, honestly, if I could, I would just be. I would just be in pajamas 24 7. I do like dressing up though, don't get me wrong. I love dressing up, wearing the heels and everything, nice dress once in a while. But like, as I get older, I kind of like prioritize like comfiness. Oh my gosh, Mac, what are you doing? Comfiness over like style. You know what I mean? Like before when I was younger, it'd be like, oh, I'm gonna wear these like super painful he heels the whole night. They're not comfortable at all, but they're cute, you know? But now I'm just like, I don't know. Give me some, give me some like, I don't know, slippers, <laughs> fuzzy slippers. Heels, what are they? Do you guys wear heels? I loved, I love heels because like, I wish I was 5'8". I wish I was 5'8". If I could just go back in time and just like be born again, like I would be like, universe, please make me 5'8". That's like the perfect height for me. Um, So when I wear heels, I'm like 5'9", which is great. I feel like I can tower over some people, which is good. <laughs> I'm usually always looking up. Tater, welcome in! Hi y'all, sorry I'm late. What have, what have I missed? How is everyone? Welcome in, Tater. Good to see you. I am good. How are you? I was just telling chat how I wish I was taller. I'm the tallest 5'3 you'll ever be. Hey, you know, like us kind of like shorter girlies the personality we have the personality big personality short body <laughs> i like wearing platforms they make me look like five, ten, six, six foot v you're six you, oh my gosh a six foot v that's crazy that's crazy <laughs> i would be as tall as my husband when I wear heels, I look at my at hubby crossing and I'm just like, we're leveled now. You don't have to look downwards at me anymore. V is a tall queen, now I love her even more. Yeah. Wait, V, are you taller than me? Green Bean, welcome in. How are you doing today? Good to see you guys. Good to see all my lovely butterflies. I'm really happy to see you guys. Oh, we need to get some apples. Five seven and oh my gosh, V's taller than me. That's crazy. 
That's crazy. Everyone's taller than me. Uh, I'm five four and a half, or five five. Jilly's five three. I'm taller than my husband, but he can reach further than me. I love my little blue chunky butterfly. The design is so cute. Oh, the design is so yes. I'm glad you guys like it. I'm really glad. I fell in love with it when I saw it. I was so happy that I found like Squishmallow badges. So I was like immediately yes. Immediately yes. I was like, I'm buying this. And I'm telling you guys immediately that the member badges are going to be Squishmallows. Um, I'm glad you guys like them. They're really chunky. I wish I was tall and 5'5", five five, maybe 5'7 five with heels. Okay, so me and Tater are the same height. I don't know. At the same time, it's like good to also just be grateful for what you are. You know what I mean? Like, I'm like, okay, I've accepted the fact that I'm shorter. But that's what heels are for, right? That's what heels are for. The tallest heels I've ever worn were actually like five inches. <laughs> Which was insane because I'm like, I, can't, I look like a baby giraffe. Like I literally walk, I'm walking like a baby giraffe who just was born and doesn't know how to walk. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Slay Kayla. Candy coated, welcome in. How's it going Candy? I'm 4'11 short too. We're fun sized. Our personalities make up for it. Right? We have big personalities. Are you guys introverts or extroverts by the way? Let me know. Because I've realized recently, I think I've become more extroverted in real life. Which is a big change. I feel like I get really tired. Like, my social battery is kind of... It runs out sometimes. Introvert Green, Be Green Bean says, I'm 4'9 on my driver's license. <laughs> Weird Chihuahua, small but mighty. Set up. That, that literally, <laughs> that made my day. Chihuahuas are the loudest dogs, though. They're the loudest dogs. Oh, wait, let me see Vane's message. Um, actually not good in Finland. Yesterday there was a horrifying thing, but I'm not going to tell about it. <gasps> oh, I'm sorry, Vane. I'm so sorry, Vane. I hope that everything gets well soon. Hope everything's okay with you and like everyone there. Like, I'm so sorry to hear that. I'm sorry, Vane. Introverted, unless I'm with my people, then I'm extra. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think that's me. Oh, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. <gasps> Carly May Raid! Hello, guys! Hello. Sorry, you just, you literally came. <laughs> My alarm just rang right next to the mic just as you guys came in, so I apologize to your ears. I'm so sorry. Um, but welcome in, everybody. Carly May, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a great stream. Let me know what you guys were up to. Also, guys, subscribe to the lovely Carly May. Go do it right now. Right now. Dragonite, welcome in. Lion Spear, hello. Haunting Haunter, welcome in. Razzy and Arisha, hello. Sir Quackington, Linus, Lapis Lazuli. Swifty Gamer, Big Cheese, I like your name. Welcome in, guys. How was the stream? What were you guys up to? I think I saw it was Animal Crossing, but what were you guys up to? Felt like a proper raid alarm. <laughs> I think my phone was just like, it, it knew that there was a raid coming, and it's like, let me just scare the bejesus out of Kayla real quick. Raid alarm. How are you guys doing today, raiders? How are you guys doing? Happy Wednesday, happy time zones. I'm actually um, struggling with the uh, pansy overgrowth on this island. Let me know if you guys have pansies as your flowers because it is, it is a struggle. They just multiply so fast. They multiply really fast, guys. I'm scared. Swifty forever, welcome in. I love your name. I'm a huge Swifty too. I, I appreciate your name. I appreciate it. What is your favorite Taylor Swift song? We were working on my island doing some beach decorating. Nice. Beaches are fun. I think they're really pretty, especially like at nighttime. 
Pansy is my island flowers. Haunting Hunter, hello. All these Animal Crossing streamers I come up across, I wanna play Animal Crossing again. Yeah, I think it's a great idea, honestly. Sometimes we just have to check in with our villagers and just be like, are you okay? Are you okay? I know like sweeping the plaza 24 seven gets a little lonely without, without us there, but that's so hard. There's so many. I know, right? There's so many. I'm so excited. It's um, Tortured Post Department release month, which is makes April iconic. Oh, did you guys actually do anything? Like, did you guys do any April Fool's pranks? Because it's officially April and I'm scared. I was very scared on April 1st. I was like worried because my husband, my husband loves pranks, but I was spared this time. Um, yeah, I hope all the raiders are doing good. Thank you guys for the hearts. Thank you guys so much. I haven't played since like early 2023. I forgot who's on my island. <gasps> oh no. Would you restart? Would you restart haunting? Thank you, Kayla. Today when I talked about the mouse thing to my friends, I just started crying. So I wasn't able to play some ball games with everyone. I'm sorry, Bane. I'm so sorry. But you know, that's life, like, we just have to have gratitude for the memories and things we do have, you know? I hope that you you feel better soon, Vin. I'm not good at them. I am the April Fool. <laughs> it is April and I am a fool. So there's that. There's that. I am a fool. I look at this island, I look at the back of the island and I realize the mess there and I am a fool and it is April no pranks this year <laughs> I know I hate them I sometimes they're so mean sometimes the pranks are really mean I'm just like this is too far I saw some on Twitter I was like this is too much like a s harmless one is fine you know what I mean but if they're mean I don't like it Oshawa thank you for coming in with the raid I was doing homework good luck with your homework I hope it's finished I hope it's all good welcome in I might restart. I gotta see who's on my island and what the situation of my island is. Oh yeah. That's always good. That's always good. Um, okay, let's get started with getting rid of this ugly cliff. The pansy cliff. We need to get rid of it. Um, yeah, I'm just planning on actually just destroying every single default cliff that we have on this island to make like cuter you know terraforming of my own felt the back of my island is so bad <laughs> i don't know do you guys remember like back in the days in animal crossing we used to think that like the islands were so small and we're like oh in the um 2.0 update we should get like a bigger island a lot of people were saying that now i'm just like i wish the island was a little bit smaller i don't know what do you guys what do you guys think like do you think it's too big I feel like it's a little too big. It's pretty hard to fill in the whole island. You just finished! Nice, Oshawott! I want more villagers to fill it out. More villagers, yeah. Or like... Like 15 villagers, maybe. <gasps> Thank you guys for 30 likes on the stream. Thank you guys so much. 30 like hype in chat. The front of my island is small. The back is so huge. Yeah, why is the back so big? Thank you for subbing Swifty Forever. Thank you so much. Welcome to the Butterfly Family. Thank you, thank you. Thank you guys for the hearts. Do you guys like the terraforming sounds? Like the in-game sounds? Should I turn it on? Sometimes people like it and it's like ASMR. <laughs> Oh, Haunting! Thank you for subscribing! Linus, thank you for subscribing! Thank you guys for joining the Butterfly family. So lovely to have you- Oh, jeez. I forgot to turn off my- Oh, gosh. I forgot to turn off my- Alarms. <laughs> F in the chat, guys. F in the chat. F in the chat. I'm putting my phone on airplane mode. I'm so sorry. I'm getting, like, calls and, like, I have to go soon. In, like, 20 minutes. Um, I'm so sorry, guys. That's such a cute name. If you need time, you need to take it, but no other pet will ever... Exactly, yeah. No, 
you know, like it's, it's hard to, it's never, you're never replacing the pet you have, you know? You're never replacing them. You're just making room for more love in the future. Something funny about me when I made my YouTube account, I named myself after Pokemon because I love Pokemon. I like Animal Crossing more. You know what they should do? They should do like an Animal Crossing Pokemon um, like collaboration of some sort. Like a Pokemon villager hybrid of some sort. Thank you for the lurk, Carly. Thank you so much. Make sure you, you know, don't forget your post-stream self-care, which is always important. Don't feel like you have to, you know, stay here if you want to, like, go take care of yourself. That's more important. Yeah, like an Animal Crossing Pokemon. Oh, I would love that. Because I feel like the communities are pretty... Or, like, the game... You know, the vibes of the games are kind of similar. Like, they're kind of nostalgic. They're cute. Like, there's some cute villagers. There's some cute Pokemon. The raid was crazy. Yeah, I really appreciate it, Carly Mae. My Sakura Island had a good run. It was beautiful. Guys, you have to check out Happy Pokemon's Island. I don't know if it's the one you're talking about, but like a past island. I did a tour on the channel and it's so beautiful. It is so beautiful. It is the Japanese island tour, like one of the recent island tours. Happy Pokemon's Island. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Could never do that myself um so now i pop into more animal crossing screams than pokemon i tell people i like animal crossing more i always confuse people due to my name and completely different likes is so haunters your favorite pokemon i'm guessing do you guys have a favorite pokemon i used to always say eevee but then i was like i do like espeon i do like espeon too just for aesthetic purposes, you know? Just like the design's really pretty. Enjoying your vibes, perfect way to chill after stream. Thank you, Carly Mae. I'm so happy that you, you're here. I'm really happy. Thank you so much for saying that. Haunter is my favorite Pokemon. I love Lapras. Oh, you guys, I used to love Lapras too as a kid. I used to ride it, like do the surf thingy and ride the uh, Lapras in the ocean. It was so fun. My favorite is Mew. Oh, Mew is a cutie. Mew is a cutie. I also like Mew too. Mew too is cool. I saw like a life-size, I don't know if it's like, I mean, we'll never know, but like there was like a life-size Mew too um, in the Nintendo store in Japan when I went. It was so cool. It was like in the in the lab and stuff. So cool. I don't know if you guys have seen it. And then Mewtwo. Mew as well. <laughs> so I don't confuse you guys. I have a Fairy Crow Island and it's so cute. I'm so proud of myself. Fairy Crow Islands are the best. They're the best. Okay, I give up on this. I give up on this. Goodbye. Let's go check out the plaza and see who is doing zoomies. I need a break from this. Th that was stressful. Oh, there's nobody here. Okay, we have to see if there's any houses we have to move because they're all kind of like Not done um, Derwin's house. Let's do Derwin's house Thank you for joining the discord haunter. I love Pikachu. It's me in a Pokemon form short but mighty <laughs> Set up that is too good short but mighty. It's like a chihuahua small but mighty very very powerful i feel like chihuahuas are just like the funniest dogs they're always also funny yes what tater said vane what tater said it'll be okay it'll be okay i know it's hard but brooke welcome in good to see you How's it going, Brooke? Happy Wednesday. Um, okay, let's move. I almost said Freckles. What's his name? What's his name? Derwin? 
I'm good, Brooke. How are you? Good to see you. Oh my word, I love the colorful blankets. They are so flipping beautiful. I love patchwork. Yeah, I do too. So pretty. How's it going, Brooke? How's it going, Brooke? Um, Island Tome. There we go. Not the rat emoji. The good old rat emoji. I'm doing okay. That's good. Oh, chat, guys. We didn't do the 1 out of 10 check-in, so 1 out of 10, how are we feeling today? Let me know in the chat. I'm gonna say my day is like a 7. It's like an okay day. Hopefully you guys have a better day. Um, maybe an 8 after the stream, though. Swing it! Welcome in, welcome in. How are you? Swing it's a 10. Let's go! Set up an 8. Nice, nice. It's giving fabulous rat. It's giving, what's the, the rat called? What is the rat called? Remy? It's giving Remy. Everett, hello. Everett with a three? I'm sorry about that. I hope that you get a 10. I hope we get a 10 after the stream. The chaos will make it a 10. Durin is so underrated. He is, he's really cute. Um, If you could add one species to Animal Crossing, what would it be? Ooh, that's a really good question. Um. I would say... Hmm. I don't know. Let me think about it. What would you guys add? Like, what species would you guys add to Animal Crossing? I always call him Ratatouille, and it's Remy! <laughs> I know, I was about to say- I was about to say Ratatouille. But Ratatouille is the food. It's the food. Ratatouille. Setup says bats. <gasps> I'm scared of bats, though. I'm, like, horrified of bats. Sunny Misty, welcome in, welcome in. Can I come? Oh, sorry, the island is closed currently because we're doing some construction, but if you are interested in island parties and stuff, we do do those on the channel sometimes, so make sure you guys are subscribed. Bats would be so cool. I'm scared of bats, guys. I It's a gnar for me. It's a gnar. I have seen bats in my days, and they're... They just stare at you upside down, and I'm like... <gasps> I'm scared. I'm horrified. But maybe, like, a cartoon version would be cute. Okay, where should we put this house? Where should we put this house? Hi, Christian! How's it going? Should we put a house here? Oh, we did this last stream, too. Hmm. I need to search for a spot. Ooh, a butterfly. Exactly. Actually, a, a cute, like, a cute butterfly. Not like a scary, literal, realistic insect. But like a cute one. Like a cartoon version. Ooh, some sort of reptile. Honestly, a snake would be kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know how that would work because they would have to stand up, I guess. Okay, let's move the house. I don't know, guys. Maybe here? Move over here. Imagine a butterfly villager watch you catch butterflies and selling it after you already donated. They're gonna be so mad. That's like the hamster villagers with the hamster cage item. Can you imagine if you're a hamster and you go into your like neighbor's house and there's like a another hamster in a cage? I would fight. I would go to Tom Nook and protest. Be like, why is my brother in a cage? Dinos would be dope, I agree. Oh wait, yes. Yes, 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 dinosaurs. Um, I do like dinosaurs. Capybara villager or NPC when? Better be tomorrow. Better be tomorrow. They're so cute. Iguanas. Oh my goodness. That reminds me of the time that I saw like an iguana colony. Like a literal colony when I was in Mexico. And they were just basking in the sun just like staring at me. It was, am it was amazing. I was like this is a sight to be seen. Like you don't see that every day. You know like just a colony of them on a rock. 
<laughs> that would be a cool, like, an iguana villager. Linus, welcome back, welcome back. Bye, Vane. Thank you so much for being here. I'm so glad that this stream helped you. And, you know, keep yourself happy. Take good care of yourself. Know that, you know, time will help everything. Time always helps. Maybe a hedgehog. Ooh, yes, hedgehog. Absolutely. Absolutely. Human cages? Oh, gosh. Oh, goodness, Candy. All right, this needs to be fixed. Like that. Anarisha, welcome back. Welcome back. Bearded dragon? What about axolotls? What do you guys think of the axolotl? Dr. Skunk. Or what is his name? Dr. Shrunk? Shrunk? Dr. Shrink? It's kind of horrifying. The axolotls in Animal Crossing. Um... I guess we just have to- I need to get rid of this cliff over here. They could totally color a squirrel villager as a red panda so easily. Yes! Oh my gosh! Red pandas all the way! They're so cute! Red pandas are adorable. A Komodo dragon? Komodo dragons are so cool. I love them. Okay, we're gonna actually turn this into like a... Terraformed cliff build on its own. Dr. Skunk. <laughs> I also do not like skunks. Don't know why I said that. Skunks? I literally... Have you guys ever been sprayed by skunk? Have you guys ever been violated by skunk? Because it is the worst thing. Momo Mochi, thank you for subscribing. Thank you so much. Welcome to the butterfly family. Leave kicks alone. <laughs> hey, I stand kicks. I love kicks. He always is a sweetie, but a real-life skunk literally sprayed me once. Oh, like, sprayed near me. And I saw it, and let's just say it is the worst thing you will ever smell. I truly was near skunks. But it, like, sprayed near me, and I smell- oh my gosh, the smell. Horrendous. New perfume! Who needs perfume? Anybody play Zelda Tears of the Kingdom? Oh yeah, how is- does anyone play that still? Aren't the Abel's hedgehogs or the porcupines? I think they're hedgehogs. I think hedgehogs are adorable. My grandma actually, like, she found a hedgehog that was, like, hurt in the middle of the road and she adopted it and she just took care of it and I got to play with it. It was so cute. I got to hold it and feed it. So I definitely think hedgehogs would be great in Animal Crossing. More hedgehogs. They're so, so cute. I would love fish villagers, sharks, and pufferfish. Ooh, a pufferfish would be cute. That would be cute. I'm a bit late. I bought it last month, but I'm loving the horses and stuff. Yeah, Zelda. The horses in Zelda are really... It's fun to ride them. I've only played Breath of the Wild, though, which was really fun. Giving fish villagers sushi! Oh, no! Oh, my goodness. Imagine. Imagine. That is... That is something. And then they eat it, and you're just like, you're a cannibal. Loving the Wild World music. Have you... Did you have um, Wild World back in the day, Everett? W game. Wonderful game. Except the villagers leave without telling you. Which is a problem. I played Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. Nice. Thank you, Ashwat. Thank you for lurking and saying that. Glad you guys are enjoying. Um, okay. I have a few more minutes. I have five minutes till I have to go. Ooh, a corgi or a Persian cat. It was my first Animal Crossing game and I was obsessed. I would play every day after school. Oh, yeah, the memories are so, I don't know, like the game is so, the music, game, so, so, so nostalgic. I used to play Wild World with my little sister as a kid and I used to literally have the best time every day just like absolutely ruining her island. I was like 10 years old, so I was like, a menace, right? Ruined her island, stole all her fruits, 
when did we like it was just a sisterly thing you know Drop villagers because I miss Gracie. Oh, Gracie was so cute. I miss Gracie. I loved, and I remember Shampoodle too. I used to love Shampoodle because it was pink. Animal Crossing is my first AC game. Good game to start, to be honest. To start with. Really good game. Do you guys have a favorite Animal Crossing game out of all, like the whole franchise? Because I've played, I think, I've played Pocket Camp, I've played Wild World, New Horizons. I still think um, New Horizons is the best, to be honest. We took New Leaf for granted. Yeah, I heard that that was really good. I heard a lot of people liked that one. Oh, Harriet the hairdresser! Yes, Harriet. She's in this game. I think she's in New Horizons. Yeah, she's in New Horizons, too. Which is nice. I was 10 too and I was on my brother's island. I wasn't allowed to decorate their house, but then I got my own copy for Christmas. Oh, that was the best. Like getting a game like as a kid for, for Christmas present. It's great, great present. And the dude that shows up when you swim. Oh, Pascal, right? Are you talking about Pascal? My first was Pocket Camp, and that's when I got hooked on New Horizons. I want to play the old ones. Yeah. Oh my gosh. The old ones are so... They're actually... They're way more simple and kind of slow-paced, but it is so, so fun, though. Because it's so nostalgic. It just reminds you of simpler times, you know? Oh gosh. Um, I think I'm just going to do this. Hey, man. Yeah, Pascal is like a chill dude. Oh, this is horrible. We're not going to do this. We're not gonna do a second level, I think. I miss the police dogs. Wait, what? There were police dogs? Actually, really love Pocket Camp, but it won't run for the newest phone. I upgraded to it, so I haven't played in a couple years. Oh, Pocket Camp was got it was nice. Um, I'm sorry that you can't play it anymore, Lapis. You know, that's the thing about technology, like everything just changes and then you like lose things. I was talking about this the other day with someone. I was like, I would kill to be able to still play, you know, childhood games, see childhood videos that can't be converted anymore nowadays, you know, from the old um, cameras or the old consoles and stuff. I would love to see that stuff. There were cops in the GameCube one. What the heck? I want cops here. I want like a chihuahua cop. I think that would be so funny. Just a chihuahua villager with like a police outfit. <laughs> Why did I think about that? MD, welcome in, welcome in. Can you just imagine chihuahua villagers? I would love a city I can terraform, only way I'll ever do city core. <laughs> city would be nice. I feel like that might be the next one. Elixia, welcome in. Okay. I have three more minutes still have to go. Oh gosh, what should I do? Should we just chat? Should we just chat? Chat? I think one was a bulldog and the other was I don't remember. Oh, oh yes, yes, yes. Candy, I remember what you're talking about. I, I have a very distant memory of a bulldog in Animal Crossing. Wait, I need to search this up real quick. I need to search this up. Um, one second. One second. Dog, police, Animal Crossing. <gasps> oh my gosh, his name is Booker. Oh, guys, search up the Bulldog Police Animal Crossing. He's so cute. His name is Booker. I remember this. Actually, I do remember this. I joined right in time. Thank you for joining, MD. Oh my gosh, I'm drifting. Wait, I'm just staring at this waterfall, walking into the cliff. 
love that. Um, a tear, I believe, was the other one. Oh my gosh, that's so cute, guys. There was copper as well. I remember them now. Yes, I do. I don't know how I know them, because I don't know if they were in Wild World. Um, who is the one villager that got deleted? You would not notice, honestly. Mm. Like, maybe one of the hippos, I would say. Not Bubbles, though. Not Bubbles, though. Maybe Bertha. I would say Bertha. Bertha all the way. All right, guys. I have... I have an appointment to go to, literally. Like, a Zoom appointment in, like three minutes so i have to go um but thank you guys so much for being here today and vibing and chatting with me thank you carly may for the raid as always don't forget to like this stream if you guys enjoyed and subscribe to join the family our little growing family um i'll try to stream on youtube i think in like two days or so three days or so um bye carly thank you so much bye random animal crossing youtuber goodbye linus thank you for joining Oh, Dee Dee says Al, one of the lions. Enjoy your Zoom. Thank you, Setup. Bye, happy Pokemon. Bye, Anarisha. Have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day, guys. Take care. Stay safe. Bye, Jilly. Stay amazing.